Hi there, Internet. Moose Boy here with a... Jesus wept. <laughs> well, let's do another take of that. <laughs> Yikes. Always buy strap locks, kids. Always. <laughs> okay, let's go for take two. <laughs> Hi, Internet. This is Moose Boy with another tone report for an electric guitar. This is a, a Dan Electro 12 string electric guitar. And I've got to admit that I do have a Dan Electro electric 12 string guitar, but it's actually a double neck. It's a 612 uh, double neck and uh, it's getting heavy enough that a man of my distinguished vintage, might we say, is having a little trouble actually slinging it around his shoulders and playing it. So very regretfully, I'm uh, putting it up on eBay and I'm selling it. But I knew that I, kn I wanted another one. So I've got a single neck Dan Electro 12 string here. And uh, I, I love the look and the sound and the feel of these guitars. This one, it has the easiest playing neck I've ever played on a 12 string. So it's really nice. Uh, unlike some of my more expensive uh, carvings and fenders, this one is made in Korea. Uh, the wood is not anything, uh, it's not a premium wood by any means. It's kind of a mystery wood. It's painted gloss black. And uh, some of the uh, appointments like the binding and the uh, pick guard kind of look like they came out of a 1960s kitchen. So it's got this retro kind of cool vibey look. The pickups too are uh, this uh, really unusual Dan Electro design. It, it's uh, lipstick tube pickups essentially. So. That's, uh, that's the whole thing about Danos. They've got this really cool vibe. Now, for my friends that don't play guitar, and I must admit I have a few uh, that I haven't converted yet, uh, why a 12 string? Well, isn't it tougher to play? Well, yeah. Uh, but here's the difference, mainly. Uh, with a six string, when you play the strings, you have a sound that's like this. trying to play half the strings there. With a 12 string, you get So it's got this great big jangly sound. If the guitar sounds like a piano, the 12 string sounds like a harpsichord because it's got all this top end on it. It's got all this wonderful top end uh, shimmer to it. So uh, what are some songs that might sound good on a 12 string? Well, let's see. That's on the neck pickup, by the way. Uh, here's another one. Nice. Let's go to uh, both pickups here, see if we can find some Beatles. Yeah. Oi, where's Ringo? Oh, he's right behind me. There he is. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, uh, violating the uh, prime rule of guitar players, I'll play. Yeah, 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 I know. No stairway to heaven. Well, I'm not going to do Freebird on this. Okay, guaranteed. Anyway, let's go down to the bridge pickup here. And uh, let's see. Here's where it gets really jangly. So we need some birds, don't we? Oh yeah, or some hollies. And 
that, my friends, is why you need a 12-string guitar. Again, it's a Dan Electro. It's not that expensive. Uh, it's just a fun guitar to have to play around with. Uh, I'm going to keep this one in my arsenal. I'm going to regrettably sell my other one that's a double neck. The double neck looks so cool, but it's just not practical for me anymore. So anyway, I'm going to keep on rocking here and uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you soon. Mm -hmm.